This is Sandra Porter, and today I'm going to show you how to find and format an amino acid sequence encoded by a specific exon. We'll begin by finding our gene in the gene database at the NCBI. I'm going to look for the human beta globin gene. This gene codes for the beta chains of hemoglobin. I enter the symbol for the beta globin gene, HBB, and click search. 1,000 196 records in the gene database match my query. Luckily, the record for the human beta globin gene is towards the top. Clicking the link takes me to the database record for this gene. Now I scroll down to the genomic region section to find the sequence viewer. Since I'm going to be looking at the reference sequence, I select that choice from the menu. I touch the Tools button and choose Sequence Text View. This shows me the structure of this gene. The 5' prime and 3' prime untranslated regions are shaded in light purple, the introns are shaded with light green, and the coding regions of the exons are highlighted in pink with the amino acid sequence underneath. The DNA sequences in the coding regions are underlined to show the codons for each amino acid. I can identify the first exon because the first codon in that exon is a methionine, which is the start codon. I can identify the last exon because it ends in a stop codon. The stop codon is represented by a star. Now, I copy the sequence of the second exon and I paste it into a second program for formatting. I delete the DNA sequences and then I delete the spaces between the amino acids. When I'm finished with formatting, I can copy my sequence and use it in other applications. 